Hi, this is Mike Rosanik of Diesel Progress. I'm with Julie Ferber, who is Executive Director of Electrification at Cummins. A big day. They've just unveiled the vehicle behind us. Um, and Cummins is making a real push into the electrification business. Why is now the time to do that? So I think a number of reasons. I think a number of things are coming to play. I think regulations are getting stronger. I think technology is getting to the point where it's applicable in some of the sectors. And I think the cost of technology is coming down. So I think all those things are coming to play. And just the continued push for cleaner air um, and a better climate. And why does Cummins particularly, the point's been made several times as far as why Cummins feels it's uniquely positioned in these markets why is that so i think there's a number of reasons i think you know we have always been at the forefront of technology and i think we'll continue to do so i think we offer scale we offer um, security of supply to our customers and we can also offer a full choice of portfolio so for i think for a you know for a number of years to, uh, going forward there'll be a need for all different types of powertrains and cummins is going to be able to deliver whatever the customers want at that particular time and need to do the most effective way they do their work now, the timetable for electric powertrains is? So we will have our first fully electric powertrain launched at the end of 2019, and that will be for the transit bus market initially. And then we'll have closely followed behind by a range extended powertrain system early in 2020. Um, and that again will be for the transit bus market, but we'll be quickly um, bringing out applications for other markets. So closely followed behind by some of our off-highway markets, some material handling markets, and then on into more kind of regional truck applications. <laughs> Which is what we're seeing here. So the we'll timetable for this is in the. It's a little late. So it's in the 2020s. Okay. Well, that's the story on a rainy day here from Cummins, which it's interesting because it works in the rain. So any of you people who are worried about electrification products working in the rain, thanks for watching.